Hey, this is Oingel, and it's been a while, but I'm back with something a little different. I got Call of Duty for the Xbox, and not only did I get the disc, but here it is. The cheapest Xbox I could possibly get my hands on. The 4 gigabyte Slim. And uh, hell definitely froze over because I never expected to do this. I was totally happy with the PS3 and uh, still am. But with the network down and down for uh, over a week and no end in sight, I just couldn't stand it anymore. I had to get my fix. So the only place to play it, with the exception of the play the, the PC, I suppose, but who's going to do that, uh, is to go ahead and get a console. And I don't know, given how much time I've put into this game, I figure the $250 it costs to get this in the game really... Uh, will pay off over time. Um, I found it uh, immensely frustrating <laughs> to uh, to play on the Xbox. Um, but I'm not going to do a comparison or anything like that. It's just, you know, the, whatever. The game is the game. That's why I uh, have it. Uh, I don't really care about one system versus the other. But, uh, yeah, here we go. <laughs> the two The two systems right next to each other sitting on top of my old uh, art box, uh, which I don't really do anymore because now I use all my time up playing video games. Um, so there it is. This is uh, unboxing all the way to the first game, and this is the first game right here. Knife only, uh, very, very first game, and um, right off the bat, I kind of fail a little bit right here, and I'll tell you why I fail. I knew that the... the controller was different on the PS3 and the Xbox. What I didn't realize is that it was significantly different. I just thought that the joystick was in a different location, but the bumper and triggers are reversed. So every time I go, you know, to stab or every time I go to throw a grenade, or not a grenade, a tomahawk or, you know, whatever. I mean, I've been playing longer than this game, but in this game, I, I just have a knife and that's it. No tomahawk, no ballistic knife. But anyway, half the time, especially in a panic, just when your muscle memory kicks in, I go to pull the trigger because I think that's going to, uh, you know, do one thing and it does something else. I just, this is just unfathomable to me. Like, what kind of legal problem was it to just make them the same? Why, why did we have to have these competing standards and now, if I go back and forth, this is going to... Who who else does this? I know other people play both the PlayStation and the Xbox. Do you have any tricks for this? Do you just get used to it after a while? I, I just don't get it. But anyway, um, this was pretty good, given it was my first game. Um, and given the fact that uh, I am just completely fumbling around on this uh, controller, trying to figure out how to make it work for me. Now, this right here... Why did it bounce back? Oh, I know why it bounced back in my face. God damn it. I thought that that piece of wood there was actually the opening, and I was throwing it through the opening. Well, anyway. Knifing's a little bit easier. Uh, when I played on my gun uh, account and my sniper account, um, it, you know, that's where I was really just pulling the wrong trigger or pressing the wrong button all the time. And it's gotten a little better over time. All right, enough ranting about that. Um, knifing is still knifing. I don't really see the difference between this game uh, on this platform versus the PlayStation. Um, I noticed some of the graphics are a little bit different, like fire, actually, like Napalm Strike Fire looks very different. Um, it's kind of, I don't know, in a way more realistic, but I think that it looks better on the PlayStation. It kind of has more transparency to it. But anyway, um, basically I wanted to say in this video was, uh, yeah, I've been gone for a while. Without playing the game, it was difficult to get excited about making videos, about doing voiceovers, about doing editing, about doing any of the other things that you do around this game. It made me realize editing really isn't my favorite thing. I like doing it because I like the, the gameplay. I like putting it out for you guys. I like interacting with the community. And uh, and showing off once in a while when I get uh, something fun happen like this. These guys clearly should have killed me. And I got them both. But, um, 
but yeah, I don't edit to edit. I play games and edit to continue to play games. Um, I am completely addicted to Black Ops. I can't wait till the Black Ops 3 comes out. Uh, Modern Warfare 3. Um, but in the meantime, the other bonus that's come out of this, other than the fact that I can play and the PlayStation Network as of this moment is still down, um, I get the ex escalation, escalation map, which at the time of this recording, I didn't have yet. This was on Sunday, but I've actually been playing it today and the new maps. It's pretty fun to get the new maps ahead of time. Um, so this wasn't a killer game. Um, you know, it ended up being 10 and 7, but, you know, I ran around like crazy. Uh, this isn't uh, camping. This isn't, uh, I don't know. I did the best I could with the fact that I was in this weird alien world known as Call of Duty on the Xbox. Um, I, I, I gotta say there are some things about the Xbox I definitely like. They are, de they are way more connected into the network, that's for sure. I know there's other features in here that are better than the PlayStation Network that I just haven't uh, used yet and maybe just don't even care about. I don't know. But... Um, yeah, uh, the other thing is I have, uh, uh, basically, I bought the family pack, which comes with uh, four gold accounts, and so I did it for me and my wife, and that ended me with two more. So I've got Oingel, Oingel Blade, and Oingel Scope on this, just like I do on the PlayStation Network. So if you play Xbox, and you've been following me, and you want to play, or whatever, um, I am now on both. And, uh, yeah, and especially for the next month because uh, the Escalation map is out for the Xbox and it's not out for the PlayStation. I'll probably be playing a little bit more on this, but I'm going to switch back and forth. I have uh, two places that I play in my living room and then this, at this desk, which is kind of like my, my gaming room. So, uh, again, I'm, you know, sorry I've been gone for a while, but that's just because I was kind of... Uh, depressed because of no video gaming twitter facebook and youtube oingle.com for more information we just uh, redid our website 